I'm ready for it. I got a new clarinet in my hands. My new baby. It's terrific. Well, jazz phrasing is a lot to do with the way you play the eighth notes. And it's more like a triplet feel. Da, 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 da. Rather than di, da, 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 di, da, 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 da. In classical phrasing, you have triplets, but it's da, 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 da. In jazz, it's di, da, di, da, 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 doodle, doodly, doodly, do. And in classical, it's more articulated. But it's the, everything's a triplet feeling in jazz. So that's da di da da da. And classicals, it's more even eighth notes. You don't do a triplet feel in your normal, there are triplet feelings, but it's more, more tighter, you know. So you have that, that's more of a classical triplet feeling. And the jazz feeling is looser. So I don't know if that gets it across, but it's more of a feeling of I'm a loose guy rather than yes, it's that. Anyway, <laughs> so I said I'm a loose guy or I'm a classical guy, but how do you become a loose classical guy? So when I'm playing the jazzy triplets, I'm a loose guy, I'm feeling relaxed. And when I'm a classical guy, the triplets are very much more articulated. But the question is, how do I become a loose classical guy? <laughs> it just came out of me, I had to start playing.